This is your NBC 26 News Update. I'm Nina Sperano. Wisconsin just became the latest state to offer a major perk for getting vaccinated. Today, Governor Tony Evers announced that any resident 12 years and up is eligible for a $100 Visa gift card for getting the shot. You'll have to receive the shot today through Labor Day, and folks who were previously vaccinated do not qualify for the incentive. It is time, folks. I'm calling on all eligible Wisconsinites who have not gotten their COVID-19 vaccine yet to step up, roll up your sleeve, get your shot, and do your part to help Wisconsin put an end to COVID-19 once and for all. The incentive is being offered to all Wisconsin residents, and that includes college students who move to Wisconsin for the upcoming fall semester. Today, groundbreaking news in the efforts to get more shots into arms. The FDA has now fully approved the COVID-19 vaccine. This vaccine is now the nation's first shot to move past emergency use authorization. Local health officials say they hope this move will lead to more people who have been hesitant to roll up their sleeves and get the shot. Time now for a check on our forecast. Here's Chief Meteorologist Cameron Moreland. Cam? Nina, the weather has been very quiet over the last week and a half or so. Really nothing going on, lots of sunshine and dry weather. But active weather is on the way here the next six to seven days. We're going to have on and off chances for showers and thunderstorms. Anytime we have a thunderstorm, there's going to be the threat for some severe weather and also locally heavy rain. Temperatures tomorrow and Wednesday will be in the 80s to around 90, dew points in the 70s, so very warm to hot and humid. We cool down a little bit on Thursday and Friday, and then more heat and humidity pushes back in here for this upcoming weekend. It looks like by the time we get to next Monday, it will start to cool down just a bit and dry out as well. Have a great night, everybody.